Hey y'all, I'm in Shoddy. Today is the 3rd of April 2010. This is Saturday. Um, on today's episode of Youngie on the Field, today is proving a point. Why cripples shouldn't steal. Well, I'm going to give you an update on this because I have put it on YouTube. 34-year-old Cicely Nairi Wallace of Charlotte was arrested on Wednesday in connection with my MP3 player being stolen. She was in bail for and she was on bail for five hundred dollars and she was released on bail. I've gotten I've gotten little backlash because I cut my phone off at nine o'clock, so that's good. <laughs> so here goes a video I did when I was um when I when I was getting everything all situated. I do gotta warn you, however, these are the processes of something that has hap happened back in December, and these are something, and this is spur of the moment. So, the language is graphic, don't flag this video, because I have given you a disclaimer. Y'all, I just got in. Oh, Lord. Ms. Wallace. I'm going to have to go. I'm about to call Kent to tell them I need to get a guaranteed ride home. I'm finna have a um, I'm finna I'm finna I'm finna I'm finna um, I'm finna fuck this bitch flat. Oh yeah, and see y'all help us. Y'all can tell Rico that too. Alright, now here's the thing. On my old MP3 player, when I take it off the charger, it goes in. When I go and when I take it off the charger and I turn it on, it goes straight to the main menu. It'll tell me whether I want now playing or do I want Y'all God, y'all. I don't want to go to jail, though. <laughs> if I... You know what? <laughs> God, I'm, I'm I'm gonna um I'm gonna call her phone. Lord, Mecklenburg County needs to call needs to call the National Guard because when I see that little girl, I am gonna pounce on her and I'm gonna throw that little I'm gonna throw that little piece of crap phone that she got off the off the Lynx Railway trestle, like I was singing in the shower. I'm gonna throw that phone off the Lynx Railway trestle, and she and she and she know good and well she ain't getting this message too. Good and well. 
I'm on the number left, and then I'm gonna go over here to this library and get this and get this little police report. So, I found my answer clear. Okay. So they do it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna have to walk back. In. I'm gonna have to walk back. I don't wanna um I don't wanna go I don't wanna go to um jail tonight. I'm too sexy and I have too much plans to go to jail. Yay! I'm getting my MP3 player back tomorrow. But, but the worst part isn't over. The worst part is telling is is actually is actually telling my is actually telling my mother I gotta go to North Tryon Division and get my <laughs> This is gonna be sexy tomorrow. I'm gonna be looking fine too. <laughs> Lord. So after that, that was taken on the 29th. So after that happened, I went to the, um, I had a sleepless night. I couldn't sleep at all, knowing that Miss Wallace was going to go to jail soon. Hallelujah! <laughs> and then, I was on the on the train heading towards the pawn shops in South Boulevard. I was looking for a bicycle. Not because no one stole my bicycle and um it's because I'm actually in need of a bicycle so I can get fit. And then I got a call telling me to come back to the pawn mart by the associated officer on my case who actually works for the hit for the for the North Tryon division I cannot get in touch with our uh, with the chief officer on my case and the MP3 player was handed into my hands at approximately 2.13 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time after I got finished with all my paperwork in at the pawn mart, um, I ate a congratulatory taco. Hey y'all, I'm Yang Shadi. Today is Tuesday, March 30th, 2010. I got a call about 1.45 p.m. Eastern Time from this little, uh, from this little lady cop who helped me at the pawn mart yesterday. I recovered my institution. Now the biggest thing is <laughs> knowing when is Ms. Wallace going to jail because I want to see this and I want to videotape it too. <laughs> Wow. The YouTube, I'm reporting live in North Charlotte. Hey, hey! <laughs> now the dumb bitch, she let the bat, she let the entire battery run dry, and it, and and it says in the manual book. Do not let the battery run completely dry. Not if you, not for an excessive amount of time. Samsung say that on anything they have, you need to charge it up as soon as you possibly can. Which I know she don't have a computer. That's a given. She would pawn that shit off in a in a heartbeat. <laughs> I found out where she lives, but I'm not going over there. I got too much class. 
Because if I didn't have plans, I would be in jail for murder. For YouTube, I'm loving the newsroom.